Part 6. Using Resources Efficiently In order to use resources efficiently, it's important to know how much is being used at present. We can find this out by monitoring the resources that we have. For example, if we wanted to monitor how much paper we have been using, we would begin by collecting data. We might look at supplier invoices and order forms over the past 12 months. We would then record this information and compare it to see if paper use changes at certain times of the year or under other different conditions. This information can be collected and analyzed by a number of tools, including spreadsheets, checklists, graphs, stock take sheets, etc. To improve efficiency, we must reduce waste. Waste is a significant issue in the hospitality industry as it reduces profits to the business. As we've already seen, the impact on the environment caused by excessive waste is huge. Efficient use of resources should be practiced at all times. Here are some ideas on how waste can be reduced in the hospitality industry. Check your stock levels carefully and rotate stock to ensure products don't go out of date. Accurately calculate the amount of food needed for functions. Consider alternate energy sources where you can, such as solar-powered lights in the garden. Use environmentally friendly, biodegradable, and recycled products. Consider ways to make it easy for customers to be environmentally friendly, such as offering paper bags instead of plastic, encouraging guests to reuse towels, and providing recycling bins where guests can easily access them. Use reusable products instead of disposable ones. Or if you must use disposable products, use a recyclable one or a biodegradable one, such as paper instead of plastic. Buy items in bulk and refill containers. Eliminate the use of single-serve items such as sugar packets and cereal boxes. If you have excess food that's still good to eat, you could donate it to homeless shelters. Or if it is food waste, put it in a compost bin to place on the landscape grounds. Different types of waste should be disposed of correctly. Organic waste can be composted or placed in landfill. General waste should be separated for collection. Hazardous waste must be disposed of so as not to cause any pollution or health issues. Arrange for it to be taken to a hazardous waste center. Clinical waste must be placed in biohazard bags. And needles and syringes need to be placed in plastic sharps disposal containers to prevent injuries or contamination.